Now I remember 13 years ago, I had a dream to go to Japan. And when I was young, I thought that was the final destination. Then five years ago, that dream came true. But you know what? When I got to Japan, I realized that this wasn't the dream I had since I was a little kid. It was just a step along the way. What did that step represent? A small victory. Because every big win in your life is made with small victories. And what are small victories? They're called goals. To move you in the right direction to that big win. And what's that big win? It's your dream. So then doesn't it make sense to go after your big win without stepping goal by goal? Without getting victory by victory? You know, my dream changed every single year after when I was 19 years old. That was when I went to Japan. It changed every single year after that. It didn't change the content. I just changed the vehicle. How I was going to get to the dream. But you see, if I didn't get goal by goal to that to that image, that glimpse that I was chasing after, the vehicle would have never changed and that would have burned me out. Where I go, what I do is all moving in the same direction so that when I get a shot to go after the dream, whether it be Spain, Japan, America, all the steps add up and I'm right there. We will accomplish goals no matter what our big win is, no matter what our dream is, but what stops people is that most of the goals we accomplish, the small victories we get, aren't in the same direction of that dream that big win, which sticks them at the beginning point, whenever they get that glimpse into the future. Then they gotta make all this time up, gotta make up, gotta play catch up for however long to get there to the beginning point of their dream. I can't do it like this, I can't do it like that. Too many responsibilities here, too many responsibilities there. What will these people feel? All of these thoughts are gonna stack up and lead to paralysis by over-analysis. So how can we get over this paralysis by over-analysis? I want to tell you it's done by setting your intention today. What's your big win? What's your dream? What's your intention for living? What's your intention for working? And what little victories are going to move you in that direction? That's what we got to work on today. If you can do this and keep at it, YouTube, I promise you, you can be a winner. Just because you don't win doesn't mean you're not a winner. All right? Just because you fail doesn't mean you're not. It doesn't mean you are a failure. This stuff is in your control and I believe in you. So let's use this quarantine time to think a little bit about how we're going to become a winner. Yahoo YouTube. That's the video for today. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.